नमस्कार सत्याकाल एंड खम्मा घनी माई नेम इज अर्पिता कारवा एंड आई वेलकम यू बैक टू माई चैनल विद अनदर इंटरेस्टिंग वीडियो दिस वीडियो इज फॉर ऑल दोज हु आर ईदर परस्यूइंग एम ए इंग्लिश और हैव रिसेंटली कम्प्लीटेड देयर मास्टर्स इन इंग्लिश एंड आर लुकिंग फॉर जॉब अपॉर्चुनिटीज दिस वीडियो इज इवन फॉर पीपल हु आर कन्फ्यूज वेदर दे शुड प्रिपेयर फॉर यू जी सी नेट और शुड डू अ पी एच डी डिग्री Yes you guessed it right in this video i'm going to talk about all the possible career options that students can opt for after completing their masters in english literature now before starting the video i want to address all the ma english students out there guys in life a lot of people might look down upon you because you are from humanities background a lot of people would tell you that you are not into a well paying job after masters you can't like really choose a very lucrative career option some arrogant engineers and cas would even mock your degree and they will say that is this even a professional course that you are pursuing you will hear such ridiculous things throughout your life as a student of english literature but friends before blaming these people we must first blame ourselves as literature students somewhere in our heart we believe that we are less intelligent people than other science and commerce graduates we ourselves keep doubting our own profession before we talk about career options in this field it is very important for each one of us to take pride in the fact that we are literature students we are brave enough to follow our hearts and pursue our love for literature and we are people who would admire poetry even if everyone around us take up a career option as lucrative as an engineer or a doctor so be proud of being a literature student okay so now after this little pep talk let's jump to the topic of this video in this video i'm going to give you some very lucrative career options in the field of english literature following which you can make a lot of money as well as can earn a lot of respect in society this is my guarantee to you i'm also going to give you a bonus tip towards the end of the video on how you can safeguard your career if in case your plan a fails then you should be always prepared and ready with a plan b if you are looking for more such informative videos then consider subscribing we we'll regularly upload videos to help you ace your exams every sunday on our channel also 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 don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you never miss an update from our side so now without any further delay let us look at possible career options available to people after completing ma in english the first one is the most traditional and the most popular career option after ma english and that is academics now why is this the most popular career option it is because a lot of people want to become professors or teachers after doing their masters apart from the monetary benefit you get from being a teacher or a professor it's also a very noble profession and i truly believe that this is a profession that sincere students should definitely take up because these students have the potential of becoming hard working and dedicated professors and teachers who have so much to contribute to the society one option of doing so is by doing bed if you want to teach school going kids from class 1 to 12th then bed is a very good option for you friends you must not look at it as a small profession rather look at it as a very noble profession there is a lot of scope of growth there you can enter as a teacher then with your own hard work you can rise to the level of being the academic head or even become the principal of the most renowned schools across india so there's a long way to go we all feel that as a teacher we can just teach in a local school but you have never thought that as a teacher you can even teach in the best schools of india a school where the best brains are taught Why limit yourself to a local school? See it as an opportunity to teach in the best institutions possible. It's just that you have to respect your profession. The next option is teaching college students. Along with your MA, if you clear UGC NET, then you can become an assistant professor in any reputed college or university across India. Being a college professor is a very dignified profession and is very very good career option as well. The salary of a college professor ranges from 50000 to 2 lakh rupees a month. Ah. Hey. Hey. 
मैं नहीं मानता Recently a lot of other career options have popped up in the field of academics. One of them is teaching on popular online teaching platforms. These days there are so many platforms that hire teacher and take them on board for teaching different topics and subjects. So you can finish your MA, clear your UGC net exam and then join an online learning platform like Khan Academy, Byju's or even An Academy. You can also start your own coaching institute. If you want to be a self-employed person, you can start your own offline or online coaching center just like me and share your knowledge with students and also make good money. And then finally we have another important career option in the field of academics that MA students can pursue and that is being a soft skills trainer. As a soft skills trainer, you can help people become better at communication and you can also help them enhance their own personality. We all know that cracking competitive exams is a very difficult task. But what is even more challenging is cracking job interviews. Even a rank holder sometimes fail to crack an interview. The reason is simple, he hasn't worked on his personality. This is where soft skill training comes into the picture. As a soft skill trainer, you help students to become fluent at English, also become good communicator and you also teach them essential life skills. So before we move on to the next career option, here's something I want to share. If you are preparing for UGC net exam, then a very good news is out there for you. We have some amazing courses lined up on our website courses.arpitakarva.com wherein we offer complete animated video course for UGC NET Paper 1 and a complete course for UGC NET Paper 2 English Literature. Our UGC NET Paper 2 course is a detailed course and prepares students end to end for the exam. We also have separate mock test series for both UGC NET Paper 1 and 2. And those of you who are preparing for MA entrance, PhD entrance, PGT, TGT or if any one of you is doing MA English from IGNU and want a detailed course, then we also have separate courses for all these subjects and exams as well. 1000 plus students enroll in our course every year and we ensure that we help them clear their dream exams. So please go and check out our website. The link of the website is given in the description box below. For more information regarding all the courses we offer, feel free to shoot your queries on the WhatsApp number displayed on the screen and me and my team will be happy to assist you. You can also listen to free demo lectures before you decide to buy our courses so that you can familiarize yourself with the course beforehand. So do check the website today. Moving ahead, now research is another career option one can go for. There are two further options in research field. The first one is MPhil, which is a research course for two years. But this course has phased out under the new education policy and is not relevant anymore. So the other option that is popular these days is a course of PhD. Now, PhD is basically a research course for three to five years. With the new developments in the education system, this option has become very, very popular. You must be wondering, as a PhD student, I would be studying Arpata, then how would I earn? This isn't a career option. Guys, if you clear UGC net along with JRF, then as a PhD student, you get a fellowship of about 30,000 every month. So basically, in case of PhD, government gives you money to study for some more time in your life. Isn't that super cool? So that was about the second career option. Moving on to the next option, we have media and journalism. A lot of students go into this field after MA English. Did you know that a lot of famous news reporters like Barkhadat and a lot of other news anchors are actually MA English students? For a career in media and journalism, you must have good command over the language, your vocabulary must be very good and you must have a flair for writing. As English students are believed to have all these qualities, media is another very good option for them. Now let us talk about another interesting career option which is content writing and script writing. To be a content writer, you must have a very, very good vocabulary, grammar and editing skills. 
the content you write must be of superior quality and must be eye catchy. Also, it is a great profession for introverted people who do not like to interact with others so much. As a content writer, you can either work full time or you can even work as a freelancer. Another career option closely related to content writing is that of blogging. If you love writing, you can become a blogger and start your own blog. Another interesting career option that has developed during the last few years is that of a social media manager. Social media has become a great platform with a lot of opportunities for content writers. You can write captions or advertisement copies for posts on social media. So this has also come up with a great career opportunity for students who have done masters in English. Now we have come towards the end of the list. That is the last career choice we are going to talk about and that is of interpreter and a translator. Now some people use these two terms interchangeably but these jobs are very different in nature. As an interpreter only works with spoken communication whereas a translator works with text or written form of communication. So if I am in a meeting with German clients but I do not understand German language then I would hire an interpreter who would help to translate German into English for me and vice versa. Whereas if I need to understand a document written in German language then I would hire a translator who converts the document into English. Now, there are many digital tools and apps like Google Translator available which will help you translate for free. But a machine can never replace human translators because we feel emotions and then interpret the words better than machines. Now, to become an interpreter or a translator, your language skills must be very professional. And you are required to have professional knowledge of at least one more language apart from English. Guys, in today's world of globalization, knowledge of foreign languages like French, Spanish, Mandarin, etc. can open many new doors for you. So these were the top 5 career options that any MA English students can opt for. So friends, do not be afraid of what people will say. Choose the career path that you are passionate about and be proud of it. Do not restrict yourself. Explore different areas and find what makes you happy. And there are so many different career options apart from the traditional career paths. If you do not like the existing options, you can even make your own path, a completely new career. Do what no one else has done before. Take inspiration from the words of famous American poet Robert Frost who says, Two roads diverged into the woods and I took the one which was less travelled by and that has made all the difference. Okay, so now as promised, I'm here with a bonus tip before I end the video. But before that, there's a small reminder. If you are looking for more such informative videos, then consider subscribing our channel. We upload videos to help you ace all your competitive exams. Also, 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 don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you never miss an update from our side. So now it's time for the bonus tip. If you are planning to do something different, to choose a non-traditional career path, please ensure that you keep a plan B ready for yourself. Basically, if your plan A doesn't work, if you are not able to be successful at what you have chosen, you must secure your future financially by keeping a plan B ready. As a plan B, I would also suggest MA students to do B.Ed or clear UGC net exam as it will add financial security. In case your original career plan fails, then you will not be left jobless. With a BA degree or UGC net certificate in hand, you can start teaching school students or you can become a professor or a researcher in any reputed college or university across India. So that was all about today's video. I hope I was able to give you some important information related to career options and take away some of your anxiety regarding the future. If you are somebody who have any questions, any doubts, please don't hesitate to send a WhatsApp message to us on the number displayed on the screen. If you are looking for MA entrance, PhD entrance, UGC net, PGT, TGT exam updates, then you can also follow us on Instagram and Facebook. We regularly post important information related to all these exams on our social media platform. 
Moreover, we also share quick revision videos on our Insta and Facebook page every Wednesday where we help you revise all important topics in just 60 seconds. If you found this video helpful, then please like this video and also share it with other fellow aspirants. If you have any other doubts or questions, feel free to put that in the comment section below. I fondly read every comment shared in the comment section by my students. If you have any questions, any doubts related to any exams, please don't hesitate to call us on the number displayed. That's it from my side for this video lecture. I'll meet you very soon in the next video lecture. Till the time we meet next, happy learning, keep loving literature and stay tuned to arpatakarva.com.